<laughs> you can say hi to all of 108 of my subscribers. It will be on YouTube, yeah. Because I already said I was coming to see Doggett. Yeah, I know how you feel. Kids! Kids! Cheer! Ha ha! Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dog with a vlog. Coming to you guys with a brand new vlog. Um, today is gonna be... It's my day off, so we're doing some... The usual, uh... Uh, day off routine. Gonna get my hair cut right now. It's on my hair's like this and not all done up. Um, so getting my hair cut and then... Gotta run to the bank and uh, something else. There's something else I need to do. Oh, and probably maybe head to the mall because um, I need to pick up some shoes for 4th of July, uh, which is this weekend. I don't know if you guys see this vlog before or after. Um, hopefully before because there might be a 4th of July vlog. Bazing! Bazing! Um, but, so yeah, we'll just do that shit like last time. You guys were really, you guys were really feeling the vlog last time, so... Um, I hope you guys enjoy this one just as much. Let's just jump right to it. Well, can you stay well? Cause girl, I'm feeling lazy and I'm trying to hang around. Ain't trying to get out of my bed till noon. Never smell the perfume smoke. So I just went to uh, the ATM because I had to deposit a check. I have to deposit a check and I have to like actually go into the bank. And I was out here at the haircut place and there's like an ATM right there. So I was like, I'll just deposit it right here and then I'll go to the bank later. Um, and I put my card in the thing, and it was, like, card, like, unreadable. And I was super, um, I was like, what the fuck? Like, why is it not? And I did it, like, three times, and then realized I'm putting my card in the wrong way. And I was like, well, I'm a fucking idiot. So, anyway, I'm here at the haircut place. It's over my shoulder over there. Right now. Um, gonna get that fresh fade. You guys will see it after it's over. So, uh. Yeah. So here it is. Blessed. Hella blessed. My barber got it on point. She always just slays my shit up here. Boom. Blessed with that with that G E Z fade. But I don't want it to be called the G E Z fade. I just want it to be called the fade. So boom. Dog the vlog. Looking fresh and cut as hell. So we're about to head to the mall now and flex on some bitties. Before we hit the mall, I had to go ahead and cut that that good good. JK, this is just some like vanilla iced coffee from Starbucks. I'm feeling lavish today. Usually we go with McDonald's, but today I was like, I got the fresh cut, got that check I just deposited. So we got money. Just kidding, right? This is due today, so I'm pretty broke. But I'm still gonna hit the mall and cop some shit because I'm a fucking idiot. I was walking up to the door and there was like this fine ass girl in the like, drive thru. I was like, Sup, girl? She's like, Hey, what's up? And I was like, um, You wanna, you like, you look good. And she was like, thanks, you look good too. And I was like, yeah. You wanna go like, buy some shit at the mall? She's like, oh, yeah. I was like, oh, psych. I got a girlfriend. And that's kinda how that happened. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, I'm done fucking around. We're gonna go to the mall. Right. My phone, open up the fridge to make some waffles, but no more sip left in my bottle. Damn, well, it's okay. I'll top it off with scrambled eggs. Hey, you gotta work what you got. Hey, you gotta work what you got. So we're going to the mall on weekdays kind of sucks because it's exclusively old people. Old people are the only people who go to the mall on weekdays. So, we're about to get in there. Like I said, I'm really only here for the American, or like, 4th of July shoes. I kind of have an idea of what I want. They're pretty basic, but you know what? Fuck it. You gotta have some basic shoes in your collection. Y'all cop like 30 the Jordans that everybody has. So I'm gonna be basic and cop the vans that everybody Take your shoes off and kick it back. We escape the world, escape the stress. But I don't give a fuck if the house a mess. Cause we gon' handle that later. We gon' handle that later. Right now. This music. 
getting in it. Oh, I'm rocking PJs and no shirt. I smoke weed, eat yogurt. Just leaving the mall, that pretty much sums up the whole vlog. Um, we're gonna just do a quick rundown of some stuff that I picked up. I can't show you all of it. Some of it is for my girlfriend's birthday, which is coming up. Um, so we got, first we got Charlie's, Philly Steaks. I don't know if you guys have ever had Charlie's. Go get Charlie's if you haven't had it yet, because it's good. It's not as good as Pepper Jack's, but it, it's good if you're like looking for mall food. Um, but we're gonna just jump into some stuff that I picked up. I only picked up really one thing. You know, I said I went in there, was going in there for shoes. I found some shoes, but I was like, you know what? I have enough red and white, and like, or blue and white, or like red and blue, that I can just throw something together like that. I don't need to get like shoes that have an American flag on them. That's that's stupid. So I just cop this red hat that uh, you know will be kind of used as my as my go-to um, red hat because I don't really have a red hat. It's Hundreds brand. I just think this looks pretty clean. Um, so I'll be wearing this probably a lot in the vlogs and stuff. I'll just throw it on right now because flex. Got a little little hair thing going on right here. Ooh, excuse me, boy. How you do that? Anyway, um, so the rest of the stuff is stuff that I picked up for my girlfriend's birthday, so I can't show any of that. Um, but I've been having some fucking phone problems. My phone is completely busted up, uh, and right now the home button is stuck, so like just randomly Siri will open up. So I think I'm going to head to the bank, do some stuff there, and then I think I'm going to head to the Verizon store and get the new phone because, or at least check, scope it out because... This is some shit I'm tired of and I'm way past my upgrade, so uh, we're just gonna... So I guess the vlog's not even over. I guess we still have a lot more vlogging. I was just giving you a mall rundown. Whatever, we'll get in. Gonna hit him with a quick rant real quick because we're here. Um, my biggest pet peeve is people driving the wrong way in the parking lot. And that sounds stupid. You guys are probably like, that's fucking stupid. Like, why do you care so much about that? That just fucking bugs me. Like, that is, there's fucking arrows. There's arrows. And the parking spots are facing a way that you have to fucking try to go the wrong way. Like, you have to try to park the wrong way. Like, who who does this? Who's out here doing that? Who's out here being like, you know what? I'm gonna drive down the wrong fucking way so anyone who's trying to come the right way can't because I hate myself and I want everyone to suffer. Like, that makes me so mad. That makes me visibly angry. I'm gonna try to make this light. Hold up. Um, but I'm not gonna make the light. Fuck. So, nah, it just, it makes me, I could have totally fucking made that. It just makes me mad, like, legitimately pissed. We're at a stoplight, so I can just really rage. It just, like, ugh! Like, a lot of shit pisses me off. Some big pet peeves of mine that piss me off are when people say, please and thank you. Not like, please and, like, hey, can you please hand me that? Or, thanks, dude. But, like, when they say, can you do this, please and thank you? Like, I, I haven't even done it yet. Like, why are you, like, it just sounds fucking corny. So why are you saying it like that? Um, I fucking hate that shit. I hate when people say, uh, I hate when people don't use their blinkers, even if it's like just changing lanes, like use your fucking blinker. You don't got to use your blinker when you're coming out of your driveway. That kind of makes me mad when people do that. Like you don't need to use your blinker when you're coming out of the driveway. No one's behind you. If someone's behind you, you're going to hit them. So like, why are you using your blinker? So, um, but nah, I'm, so then, then I hate when people drive down the wrong way in the parking lot. Most of my pet peeves consist of people in their car because I live in a city. I'm going to be straight with everybody. I live out in the Midwest and I'm... I could safely say that this place, this city that I live in, probably has the most bad drivers per, like, square inch. Like, everybody is a fucking dick. Today, I was I was on my way to the mall, actually, and I'm driving next to this guy, and he won't let, he, I, like, I'm trying to get over. My blinker is on, and so I'm, I'm, you're at, like, a point, you know, where you can't move because there's a dude in front, and there's a dude in back, but... Like, you just, I just needed the dude in front to move, like, to go up a little bit faster so that I could pass on him. This dude, this, this, this lady, this fucking woman in, a, in the Jeep who was behind me speeds her ass up, speeds her candy ass up to so I can't get over. Like, what the fuck, man, in her Jeep Patriot? Yeah, my husband, fuck you. Like, speeds up, takes that shit from me. I was so mad because I needed to get over to, like, get my exit. If I didn't hit my exit, I would literally have to drive like a solid half mile before I'd have an opportunity to turn around because the mall is right off of an expressway. So I'd have to drive the next main street so I could flip a flip a Yui, but I think that's Yui illegal. So I probably had to drive basically down like almost downtown to like a different mall. Like I'd be closer to a different mall than I would be to this mall that I'm trying to get to. And this bitch ain't gonna get over. Like, do you see me in the car? Where else would I be going? Um, so, 
I don't even know if you can hear me. I feel like I might have had my thing plugged in the whole time. So that's how I'm feeling. I just wanted to get a quick rant in. Anyway, we are off to the bank. Just driving by uh, Doggett's house. So we're gonna run over and surprise Doggett. Um, Cause I miss her. So yeah, we're gonna. <laughs> we're out here driving. I'm letting Doggett drive my car. This is, I think, the first time anyone has ever driven my car besides me. Are you scared? Uh, terrified. Actually, that's not true. Kaylee has driven my car before. No blinker. Pet peeve number one. <laughs> you missed it. I was just talking about my pet peeves in this vlog earlier, and now you just totally did one of the pet peeves that I was talking about. Sorry. We gotta break up. Okay. Does she look good? Does she look pretty today? I totally surprised her. I actually came to her house to pee and she won't let me into her house to okay, pee. For valid reason. Well, what's the valid reason? Uh, my little sister is sleeping. Her kid's sleeping. Yeah, her um, child. Not, our, not my child, her child. No, our child. No. He refuses to admit it because he's ashamed. Our child's ugly. She has four eyes <laughs> and three arms. It's fucking bizarre. Because we're cousins. Yeah. And that's what kind of what happened. I am from Kentucky. <laughs> she is from Kentucky. And I'm from... Southside Chicago. <laughs> this is more intimate, dog get with a vlog and dog with a vlog than the last YouTube video was. How you feeling? We're going good. <laughs> oh, now we're really speeding. We went up to I think 35 there. So that was uh, dog yet. Now we're headed to the bank to do bank things. I actually really had to pee. I already said this in the video, never mind. But, uh, so yeah, we're about to head to the bank, do some bank stuff, then Verizon store. Let's get leaving the bank now. Um, banks are kind of schemy. I'm not even gonna front with anybody. I, like, went in there to close an account, and they're like, well, why don't you just do this? And, like, y'all scheming on me and shit. Fuck! I didn't really say anything like that. I was like, okay, that's fine. You're the banker. I'm an idiot. Um... So yeah, about to head to the Verizon store to scope out this iPhone 6. I probably will not be getting it today, but I would like to scope it out. I'm torn between the iPhone 6 and the iPhone 6 Plus. Um, if anybody has any suggestions on which you think would be um, better, uh, please hit that in the comments. Uh, don't be pulling any shit like, the Android Samsung Galaxy 9000. Man. Don't be pulling no shit like that. I don't want to hear it. I, you know, I do not. I do not want that shit. I want an iPhone. So sorry. So just leaving the Verizon store, I went in there with the intention of like putting down money. I was like, I'm spending money today. I'm putting it down. I was ready. But uh, unfortunately, for me. Um, my upgrade is available, but they said that I should just wait until September so I can get the, whatever the next model of the iPhone is. I need to go research. I haven't even heard anything about a new model, but I'm sure it'll be like the iPhone 6, 9, see like 69, the iPhone like 6, whatever, some, one new feature, whatever, and I'm past it. So I'm waiting the two months until September. So now I'm kind of faced with a different, um, a different case of like dilemma. Do I go and get my screen fixed on my five or do I just leave it and hope that things go okay? Cause the crack's only in the corner, but I'm missing a chunk of glass. Um, so I'm kind of deciding on that. If you'd like to leave what you think I should do in the comments, you can, I don't probably won't listen, but you can leave it if you want. Um, but yeah, in regards to the actual phone, um, I am going to do some research, and we'll see how it goes, but uh, I think this about sums up the vlog. I hope you guys liked this one. It was a little bit different than the last one, doing a little bit more uh, just everyday shit than uh, I was doing fashion and sneaker stuff like in the last one. So, it is Dog with a Vlog, and I will talk to you guys mm, super, super soon. There may be a 4th of July vlog. I don't know yet, but I will talk to you guys super, super soon. Peace. 
I'm just high where they hate on me. People tend to think all the drinks on me.